Sorry, Fendi. I found somebody else. Someone better. No, Emil. Please forgive me. I know how badly I hurt you, but I realize you're the one I love. I'm afraid it's too late for that, Fendi. No, Emil, please. I beg you, take me back. Take me back, Emil, please. Take me back. Take me back. What are you doing? Um, we don't pay you to jerk off all day. Ew, what? Uh... Listen, buddy. I don't know how else to motivate you. Look at yourself, man, and your workspace. Why can't you just do your job like a normal person? What are you, one of those types that has to enjoy what they do? Wake up, man. This is a job. You're not supposed to enjoy it. Jesus. You see the stack of claims. I want you to go home. I want you to review these case files, and I want you to report to my office tomorrow morning. Then we can discuss what to do with you. You got that? Yeah. Clean up your act, man. You don't get paid to jerk off at work. I'm a divorced prick with a gambling problem. Next page. That's me. Surprise! Christ, kid, do I have to spell it out for you? I'm your mom. Okay, your silence is kind of freaking me out a bit. Well, uh, I mean, what the fuck? Okay, I get it. This is weird. Well, why'd you come here? I wanted to see you. Still unpacking? Kinda. Okay. This has been sufficiently awkward. You need to go. Uh, I've, 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 I got work to do and... Wait, what are these? Did you make these? Yeah. What is it? Music? Or do you have one of those podcasts? N no, it's nothing like that. It's stupid, really. I just like to do voices. Voice there. acting? Yeah, c sort of. Huh. Why cassette? I mean, isn't everything on computer nowadays? I don't know. I guess it's an aesthetic thing. Uh, something about, you know, using physical media, especially cassette. Hey, hey, hey! Easy. It means a lot to me, and it's really delicate. <laughs> this piece of Stop. shit. Stop! Seriously. <clears throat> okay. Fine. Spill the beans on the vase, mister. Uh, my girlfriend, Fandy. Fandy, what the hell kind of name is that? Ex-girl. Fat bitch. She made it for me. All the more reason to smash it. No, 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 because if we break it, I'll never get my equipment back. What kind of equipment? I left some really expensive recording equipment at her house, and I, I haven't had a chance to get it. What? Screw that. Let's go get it back. No, no, it, it's late, and I have work, and she doesn't even want to. Oh, play. stop making excuses, mama's boy. This vase is leverage. We get your equipment, she gets your shitty little art fart back. Easy deal. Do I have a choice in the matter? Oh, honey, you always have choices. But if you refuse, I smash the fucking vase. Oh, oh okay. Uh, well, fine, but... Let me handle it. I don't have to explain to you. 
Ouch. Whoa, Thandy. Uh, I understand you have some of my equipment. Uh, I was wondering if maybe in exchange, my equipment for this vase would be a nice, e Thandy. Really oh, what, what is the holdup? <laughs> Excuse me, I, th I thought you were going to wait in the car. Knock on the door. Todd is in there. Who? Uh, fuck Todd, <clears throat> don't pussy out on me. Okay. Oh, come on already. <laughs> whoa, 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 wait. This is way better. What? No, 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 we gotta get out of here before she comes back. Good thing your mom can pick locks. This is a crime now. Not to mention, Daniel will never speak to me again if she ever finds Good, she doesn't deserve you. We'll be in and out before Thandy and Todd get back. Oh, you're crazy. If you think for one second that I'm gonna go in there... Got it. Hey, you... Here, please, Florence. Whoa, Florence. Holy cow, this place is so yeah, wanky. This has gone off the rails. We have to get out of here before we get in trouble. Okay, okay, Auntie Nancy, get your stuff and we'll get the F out of Dodge. I swear to God, if you touch it, I'll, I don't know what I'll do. Just don't touch anything. Here, hold this. What, hello? He said not to touch anything. Be smart ass. Okay, Dad. I really think it's a beautiful exhibit. I mean, the juxtaposition of light and shadow, it's inspiring. Is this my bathroom? I have one just like this. I got I got it this. Get out of here. Emil? How did you get in here? I changed the locks after you moved out. You kicked me out after the whole fucking other guy thing, remember? Don't patronize me, asshole. This is not okay. You and you need just to get over me and stop being such a creep. Whoa, hey, don't fall off your high horse, Missy. We're just, he's just here to get his stuff. We don't want any trouble. What's with the piece of shit vase? That's your girlfriend, dipshit. Well, finally dating in your own league, I see. Ouch. You know what? I'm calling the cops. Fanny, Fanny, come on. Oh, easy guy. I don't want to lay you out, dude. Fight me, dipshit. Oh, crazy bitch, you broke my nose. Sorry, my mama Baron sinks kicked in. Oh, shit, mom. Where'd you learn to punch like that? That's a funny story. Whoa. I gotta tell you. Get. The fuck out! Okay. Uh, you want your, uh... Get out! Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Ow! Did you really make that face? Shut up, Todd. <laughs> Seriously, <laughs> seeing you punch that dick? Mmm! <laughs> Made my year, man. <laughs> yeah, I'm just glad we got out of there without getting cuffed. I could not do jail now. It would ruin my plans. Plans? Sure. This is just a stop. Next, I go east. I don't know where I'm going to end up, but the journey is what's important. Such an idiot. Uh, you were never staying. What would be the point in that? I'm not the staying type, sweetheart. Then why did you come? What would be the point to any of this? I already told you I wanted to see you. Just because I travel doesn't mean we can't have a relationship. Hell, come with me. It's not like you're going to miss much around here. No offense. This isn't exactly my ideal living situation. It takes some adjusting, but it's not bad. Give it time. You'll love it. You don't get it. Do you? Or you don't care? Do you know how hard it was growing up without a mom? 
practically raised myself with how much my dad was away. I'm sorry, Emil. It's hard to explain, but I, 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 I never meant to hurt you. All my life, people have been telling me what's wrong with me, they, and they thought that changing me was helping me. Your father was... Life is messy. The thing is, you can't force someone down a path they don't want to take. You deserve better than me. You needed a mom, just not me. But I'm not going to apologize for bringing you into this world. There's a lot of good out there. You just have to go out of your way to find it. You going to finish your story? How you learn to kick ass? <laughs> yeah, get over here. This is a good one. All right, so, um, you know who Mike Tyson is, right? The guy with the shit on his face? Right? Exactly. Nice guy. and dreamy this morning. I didn't want to wake you. I'm off to my next destination, but I want to leave something behind so that you will always have a piece of me with you. I'm really glad we got to spend this time together. One day our collective paths will cross again. I am sure of it. But before that day comes, I know you got something you got to do. Mm-hmm. <laughs>